There can never be an army without the general. Every army must have its general. Out of the 12 disciples of Jesus, Jesus was the leader. So there is no pathway of victory without recognizing your leader. That's why God cannot do what he want to do here, number one, without a leader. So he calls Gideon together with his weaknesses. My God, the people who are used to judging their leaders, God ignored. God is a respecter of nobody. He has chosen the weak things, the ignored things of this world, just to say he's God. So he chooses Gideon and plants him as a leader. And there is no pathway of victory, the path of victory, without number one, resisting the enemy. And number two, recognizing God. Number three, recognizing God's chosen leader. Judges 6, 34. Abias writes, gathered behind him, behind him. So the leader is in front and the Abias writes, they gathered behind their leader. So there is no manifestation of the Gideon 300 minus recognizing that God chosen leader in your life.